lights and I'm here today with a Diamond Art Club sneak peek. This awesome kit is going to be coming out tomorrow, Saturday, September 16th at 9.30 a.m. Pacific Time or 12.30 p.m. Eastern Time. That's the general release. There will of course be a half hour early Diamond and Ruby tier release at 9 a.m. or 12 p.m. Eastern Time. I'm sorry, that was 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time or 12 p.m. Eastern Time. Um, but just to let you guys know when this kit is coming out first off in the video So the kit that we're looking at today is called Masai Mara Silhouette by Jim Zuckerman. Hopefully I said that right. This is a square diamond painting It's 25.6 inches by 31.9 inches or 65 centimeters by 81 centimeters And you can tell that it's a square from this blue square as well as the top of the box is blue And when they say it's a square diamond painting kit They mean that the little resin bits that you're gonna place on your canvas are actually shaped in a square There's two types of diamond painting canvases. There's brown and they're squares and like I said this one is a square shaped diamond painting so let's go ahead and get into this box so inside the box you are going to get this small sticker that is you know shows you the picture and has got some information about the kit and then you'll also be getting a toolkit this is a square toolkit and so it will come with tweezers that's one thing to note with Diamond Art Club toolkits is that square diamond painting kits come with tweezers and rounds do not. Um, that is, you know, <laughs> one of those things where I kind of use tweezers on round and squares, but I guess some people do place their their drills with tweezers, which is completely counted. I don't know how to do that, but um, some people do it and they're, they're yeah. So I guess the, the tweezers are there for you to place diamonds. So let's pick out all these goodies. Um, some of the things that you just are gonna get in every toolkit's different are your pen. So you'll get a pen and a soft squishy and these come in random colors. So this one right here is pink. I would say bubblegum pink with a soft squishy that matches. And then you're going to have a skinny four and seven placer. So another thing that is random is your washi tape. So this one right here, you can see it. It's pretty purples <laughs> and blues. It's like flowers. Um, now what you do with washi tape is you can put that around the edges of your canvas where there's a little bit of excess glue. So you keep any icky out of that sticky or you can also use it to section. You can use it with, for both on your canvas as well. Um, and then you'll also get a random cover minder. So here we have got a flower. And then there's two magnets on here. One is gonna go on the bottom of your canvas, and then this you'll put on top after you pull the plastic cover back. This will help hold your plastic cover back, and you just got a nice, cute little decoration. And then you, here are your tweezers. Now they are sharp, so be careful. <laughs> a lot of people call them murder tweezers because they are very sharp. You've got your wax and um, it comes in this really nice little heart container. It's gonna keep it fresh. Your bag of baggies, and then your tray with a stopper. So then you're going to have your diamond painting canvas. It's gonna be in this very nice dust bag. It's gonna keep it safe from, again, dust <laughs> and any other things. It does have this really nice soft backing that is so soft, it will collect dust and other things but it is such a pleasure to work on. So let's open this up. And wow, this is beautiful. Already you guys here, see that, how gorgeous. So we'll continue to open this up. Wow. Um, okay, so you guys, if your canvas is kind of not laying quite flat yet, one thing that you can do is roll this backwards so um these are poured glue canvases you can tell like poured glue because it's gonna have a clear plastic wrap on top of it as opposed to double-sided adhesive which is not as common i would say all of diamond art club's canvases are poured glue so you don't have to worry it's not as finicky as a double-sided adhesive 
but um, you can definitely roll your canvas back and look at how flat already this is laying. Now this is a self-flattening canvas, so it will do that eventually if you just let it lay out for a little bit. If you see any like bubbles or wrinkles in the plastic, don't worry, like that's not the glue, that's just this plastic cover and it can just very easily be kind of worked out, you know, if you, sorry, I did, I did that kind of off camera, but you know, if you smooth out the canvas like that. And so I'm gonna take you guys to a pan of this canvas and we'll be right back. Well, the colors in this kit are just so vibrant and gorgeous. It's funny, I'm like, my nails were not made for this kit, but they match this kit like so perfectly. <laughs> um, so you guys, on her kit, you're going to get the name of the kit right there as well as the artist. Now you know that this kit is legally licensed, that the artist has given their permission to use this image and is being compensated. All of Diamond Art Club's kits are licensed. Down here you've got a coupon code and then over on the side you've got your warranty if you have any issues with missing diamonds or glue. Now I am an affiliate of Diamond Art Club and so if it's your first time purchasing this kit has your eye or one of the kits this week. I do have a code which is emeralds20 for 20% 20 off your first purchase. Um, so feel free to use that. Now if you're not a first time purchaser there's codes everywhere. So um, like right here make sure that you are always using a code when checking out. So up at the top we've got our two legends. So we've got a legend right there and then a legend right here. And then the do what makes you sparkle at the top. And if you guys would like a close up of just this printing, like look at how clear that is. Just absolutely clear. I love that about Diamond Art Club canvases. So you are also going to get this thank you for your purchase with a message from the owner and founder. Inside there's more coupon codes, QR codes to take you to a video on how to diamond paint as well as the Facebook group and then another coupon code with the app. You'll also get a large sticker. You can put your start and end date there and this is what I put in my logbook. Um, you get this very nice large image. And then right here you have got your legend. So these are individually cut, which is gonna make kidding up so easy. Um, and so, <laughs> yeah, so helpful. Now, in Diamond Art Club's color code, everything underneath the number 150 is going to be an AB. Now, and also I do feel like saying, just clarifying this, that the color code is pretty matched up exactly to the DMC, which is a thread color code system, and a lot of diamond painting companies use this. Diamond Art Club's color code, though, does include their ABs have their own number system, as well as their special drills. So on top of these two being ABs, anything that's a special drill is going to be found at the bottom. So there's one fairy dust drill, and you guys look at that. Have you ever seen that? It is a black fairy dust drill. 310! I cannot wait to see what this is going to look like, you guys. So let's go ahead and um, look at those drills. So right here, we have got our drills. With only 17 colors, you're going to have multiple bags of each, and there is a lot. I mean, a lot of ABs in this kit. You're going to have a sticker on here that's going to let you know that these drills go to this canvas. And so I'm going to go ahead, though, and pull these drills out, and we'll look at them one by one and then we'll come back and see where those special drills go. But I think you can kind of tell based off of like if, if the fairy dust drill is a black drill, every black 
um, charted, you, you, you can see all of these are going to be that drill and it's going to be amazing. I'm so excited to look at these drills up close. Okay, friends, this canvas is going to sparkle like you just can't even imagine. <laughs> We're going to start off with those fairy dust drills. Now, you guys, you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight bags of this fairy dust 310. Now, let me get a close up and see if we can get a great, like a good picture of what this fairy dust looks like on the 310s. So can you guys kind of see in there that fairy dust? Oh my goodness, these are gonna look so cool. Okay, I'm gonna have to like break this out and put some of these down for you guys to see what this looks like on the canvas when they're all forward facing. But that is that 310 in a fairy dust drill. I have been saying for a long time, I would love to see glitter or fairy dust drills in black 310, just that keeps the integrity of the color. So that's one thing I have to say about fairy dust drills is I think it really does keep the integrity of the color, whereas APs can sometimes distort the color of the drill, but, um, and you can use that to good effect too. Um, but anyway, <laughs> okay, so then your next is gonna be six bags of this 133. This is one of your ABs. As you can see, there's that coating on there that gives off the shimmer, and you have got six bags of this 133. Crazy. You've got two bags of 741, and three bags of 498. You've got a bag of 721, a bag of 972, two bags of 3857. So your second AB, which is going to be this yellow, 975, 301, 154, three bags of 304, We've got four bags of 740, five bags of 900, three bags of 970, and then two bags of 815. And those are your drills. So lots of oranges and reds with a little brown and those fairy dust black drills, you guys, this is going to be just amazing. I'll show you the drills right there. How amazing is this going to be? Oh, and I didn't think I showed you guys maybe this little bag of 632. Okay, as far as where these special fairy dust drills go, anywhere you see this black symbol where it's like a black background with a white dot, Anywhere you see that, so it's basically anything that you can see in that black color, is going to be these fairy dust drills. And then up at the top, there are some black up there in the very top areas. So again, you'll get some of that fairy dust up there. As far as the ABs go, this one right here, this 130, is going to be the symbol number one. And this one is going to be found just right here. So there's not a ton of it, but it's gonna be right there in the yellowest part of the, the sunset. It almost looks like as if that is where the sun is. And then this orange is going to be the symbol number two. And that one is gonna be found throughout the sky. So as you can see, there's just large lines of that number two all throughout. This whole entire sky, guys, is just filled with twos. Can you see all of those twos? Let me get that up for you. Like just your, <laughs> this sky is gonna be filled with twos. So if you love, if you love ABs, <laughs> 
this is uh, this is insane. I'm telling you this. Somebody who's seen lots of kits. I don't know that I've ever seen this many special, like many bags of special drills. For, for real. <laughs> so you guys, this kit, like I said again, is going to be available tomorrow. Um, that is September 16th at 9.30 a.m. Pacific time or 12.30 p.m. Eastern time. And then that diamond and ruby tier, which is at 9 a.m. Pacific time or 12 p.m. Eastern time. Now, you guys, I'm going to take a little bit of a minute and I'm going to go and work on some of this and I'll show you what those fairy dust drills are going to look like. So before I get started on placing some of these, look at what these fairy dust drills look like up close. You can see them. You can see that glitter. So guys, I'm so excited to place these. Okay guys, I'm back. <laughs> After a quick like 20 minutes working on this as fast as I could, um, I put these down. So I put some different colors for you guys to kind of look at. So if you can see, here are the fairy dust black drills. I'll pull this off a little bit. They're against the regular drills, you can kind of see. And then you've got your ABs right here. And so yeah, that is a little bit of a preview of what it's gonna look kind of look like and what the fairy dust drills. So I'm I'm so curious. I, I feel like the camera doesn't really pick it up, but they do a sparkle. They're, just, they're really pretty. So um, you guys, that is that is <laughs> the black fairy dust drills. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in another video soon. Bye! Watch me Just follow every move Touch me Let me know you want it too Don't tell what you need